single sign-on from partners into Google applications like Gmail and Calendar. So in this scenario, Google or Gmail is the service provider and some partner of Google, presumably whose employees want to uh, use Google Apps, acts as the SAML identity provider. So that partner makes assertions as to the authentication status of their employees and based on that those employees are able to access Google Apps without having to sign in again. So Google has a kinda cool demo of how this works. Kind of a pseudo demo because it allows you to see the XML messages that are communicated between the two sites when in reality you'd never actually see those or the user wouldn't. So the scenario starts with Google uh, acting as the SAML service provider creating an XML auth -in request and it's through this message that Google indicates to the partner identity provider that it wants <coughs> the user authenticated and then Google uses the SAML bindings to submit that auth -in request over to the identity provider uh, uh, through a, a browser redirect of the user to that partner and once there the user can authenticate using in this case username password but in principle any authentication mechanism and after successful authentication the partner identity provider would uh, generate a SAML response and it's within the response that there is an assertion that indicates that the subject with name ID demo user has been successfully authenticated and then as the Google service provider did the partner identity provider sends that SAML response back to Google where after successful verification the user gets logged into their Google Apps. Very nice.